I haven't seen the intro for Persona 3 in a long time, so I don't know exact details. But definitely HD applied, that's for sure. Wait. Oh. He's not phased by the pools of blood at all. I arrived so late. Better hurry up. Iwatodai Iwa dorm. That's where I'll be staying from now on. It should be just up ahead. I like that they are, like, putting more details of him going through the dorm. Iwatodai dorm. This is it. There's the title. On a full moon. Full moon spring. Welcome. It just suddenly spawned in. Uh. You're late. I've been waiting a long time. If you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. There's no need to be scared. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. What? Actions of what? My name, if, it, if I was an organization, but a team member. Good. Time is something no one can escape. It delivers us all to the same end. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. And so, it begins. We're kind of deep, boy. Kind of like the Duke. Okay. Who's there? Hey. How are you here at this hour? Don't tell me. Wait. Hold on, girl. What are you doing? Huh? The lights. I mean, I am a new person and stranger, so I guess what. I didn't think you'd arrive so late. My name is Mitsuru Kirijo. I'm one of the students who live in this dorm. Who's he? He's a transfer student. It was a last-minute decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boys' dorm. Is it okay for him to be here? I guess we'll see. This is Yukari Takeba. She'll be a second year this spring, just like you. Looking around. Call me Takeba. Nice to meet you. Uh, yeah. Nice to meet you, too. It's getting late. You'll find your room at the end of the hall on the second floor. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? Takeba, why are you surprised no, you saying hi Go back? Away. It's courteous. It shouldn't be a surprise. Here's your room. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's all the way at the end here. Um, do you have any questions? Oh, uh, yeah. What's that contract for? Huh? Contract? What are you talking about? He doesn't seem to know what I'm talking about. Uh, can I ask you something? Depends. On your from the station, was everything okay? 
What do you mean? You don't know? No. I guess that means you're fine. Well, okay. Don't worry about it then. Okay. I'd better get going. One strange thing after another. Um, I'm sure you still have questions, but let's save them for later. Okay. Good night. Okay. Talk about. CRT TV. Life in the dorms of sorts today. The room came refurnished and everything. I'm spent. I should probably put my things in the closet and get to bed early. Save in progress. Uploading save data. That's a privilege PS Plus users have. Rewinding to previous point. When you save your game, it also saves a little bit. Of your past. Oh, interesting. You select the rewind slot, you will be returned to the point where you could roam really shortly before you save your game. Note that the rewind function does not save your new starting point automatically. If you use this function, make sure to continue save to save your game as necessary. Tutorials. Accessing the unloaded content. I have them. That was... That was good. Good morning. Did you sleep okay? I've been asked to show you the way to school. Are you ready to go? Sure. I'm ready. Great, let's set out. And this is how we'll be getting to school every day. It's a monorail. Pretty cool, huh? I honestly love the ride here. It almost feels like we're flying. Man, I wish we had transfer stations like that over here. Oh, by the way, our school's at the last stop on this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. Have you heard of it? The whole thing's man made. And our school's smack dab in the middle. Oh, look! There it is now! Morning! Well, here we are. Allow me to welcome you to Gekko Khan High School. I hope you like it. By the way, uh, uh, after the scene, you'll be okay on your own from here, right? Let's see. I guess you should go see your homeroom teacher first. The faculty office is over there on the left. They'll tell you more when you get there. Well, that about does it. Any questions before I go? Uh, sure. Yeah. Which class are you in? Me? the classroom assignments yet oh right new year hey, about last night don't tell anyone what you saw okay see you oh. okay she must mean the gun probably i was gonna say takeba was i made her the primary partner in the original game Can I go in? Yeah. I can progress in the game if I don't. Okay. Let's see where the teacher's at. Oh, are you the new student? Yeah. Huh. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You're a second year, correct? Yeah. Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Let's see, 10 years ago, your parents... Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, uh, I've been so busy, I didn't have time to read this beforehand. Uh -huh. I'm Ms. Toriyumi. I teach composition. Welcome to our school. Oh, you're the teacher that I've been, uh, seem to like. Nice to meet you. Wow, so 
such enthusiasm. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F. That's my class. Okay. But first, we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Come on, I'll show you the way. And so, another new school year is upon us. No, I'd principal. like each of you to remember the proverb. If a job's worth doing, it's worth doing well. When applied to student life, this means... Me too. <sighs> I feel that. Like nice. actually... Hey! You came to school with Takeba-san this morning, right? I saw you two walking together. You must be pretty close, huh? What's uh, the deal between you and her? Oh, uh, and uh, does she have a boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. I don't know. Oh, really? I thought you might know, but I guess not. Wait, how close are you guys? It's it to you. Who's that? Someone's talking. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Uh oh. Hey, shh. Be quiet. You're gonna get me in trouble. Okay. Seems like talking by is popular. What's up, dude? How's it going? What? Don't look at me like that. Wow. He sounds like just like. Hmm. For those who didn't know, in the original. The voice who did Junpei is the same voice who did Edward Elric. And this guy, this new guy, he sounds almost accurate. Oh my god. And you are? Me? Call me Junpei. Junpei Yuri. I transferred here when I was a second year in middle school. Pretty tough being a new kid at first, you know? So I just wanted to say, hey, see what a nice guy I am. This new VA nailed it. Oh. Hey, it's Yukatan. Didn't think we'd be in the same class again. <laughs> there you go again, acting like everybody's best friend. Try not to make him uncomfortable, okay? What? I was just being friendly. If you say so. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? Yeah, I know. Funny, huh? A little too uh, funny. Hello? Are you forgetting I'm in this class too? Anyway, I gotta ask. I heard you guys walk to school together. What's up with that? Come on. Get a dirt. That's a big deal in Japan. Huh? What are you talking about? We just happen to live in the same dorm. Why do people always jump to conclusions? Also, I just noticed that Yukari's VA is not doesn't sound the same, oh, but worried. it's almost accurate as well. Hey, you didn't tell anyone about you know what, did you? <laughs> Sorry, I'm talking over them. I'll try to control that. Okay, good. Seriously. Don't say anything about last night, okay? Talk about you're making it more. <laughs> what? Last night. Don't say it like that. Wait a minute! Don't get the wrong idea. But she caught on. Listen, I just met him yesterday, and there is absolutely nothing between us. Jeez, I have to go now. There's something I need to take care of for the archery team. You better not start any more rumors. Ah, who cares? No one takes rumors seriously anyway. Yeah. No one takes rumors lightly. The power of that. She's actually pretty popular. You're the man. Well, here's to a fun school year, dude. You ready to head out? We can walk to the station together. I'm not sure. Yeah, don't, don't underestimate the power of a yeah. rumor. It can ruin someone's reputation so bad. Yeah. 
This remix. I should say. I'm going out for a bit. Hmm? That's my boy. Have you seen the newspapers lately? There's a lot going on. I know. Severe cases of apathy syndrome are suddenly developing in people who showed no symptoms prior. It's been quite a topic of discussion. They say it's due to stress, but... Yeah, right. It's gotta be them. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. You have a one-track mind. Will you be okay out there on your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. Bye. This isn't a game, Akihiko. Let's really let him be for a while. This is how he loosen up. Yeah, it's moving like a clog. Oh, he's back. So, this is our new guest. Sophisticated gentleman. Good evening. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chairman Ikutsuki. of the board for your school. Ikutsuki. Hard to say, isn't it? That's why I don't like mm. introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. Please, have a seat. Some people would say... I apologize for the <laughs> confusion regarding your... Another name. But it may take a bit longer before you receive the proper room assignment. Is there anything you'd like to ask? Uh... Uh... Yes, why are you here? To welcome you, of course. You don't mind, do you? Speaking of which, oh. Takeba-kun, have it's you strange. seen Kirijo-kun by any chance? She's upstairs. As diligent as uh, always, uh, but it couldn't hurt to come down and say hello. He knows Kirijo. Is there anything else? Guess who else does here? There are only four students in this dorm. You, Takeba-kun here, Kirijo-kun, and a third year named Akihiko Sanada-kun. Oh, that's his room. Do you have another question? No, I'm good. Excellent. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me. I'm sure you're worn out from all these formalities. You may want to consider going to bed early. As they say, the early bird catches the bookworm. <laughs> Nice the book part. Worm. <laughs> because you're students. Uh, clever, isn't it? Alright. <laughs> You'll get used to his lame jokes. I guess I'll uh, have so. my room too. Like the chairman said, you should get some rest. Transferring schools is a real pain when you're not used to it. Good night. Dots? Should listen to them and get rest in my room. Hello there. So, how's he doing? He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently fast asleep. You checking up on me? Mr. Chairman, do you think he's. Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Come on, what do you say? I can't leave a pretty girl standing around in the cold like this. Mm, what do you think, Naomi? I mean, I'm cool with it, but if my parents found Sing, where is this? You need to know. Just drop him a text. Sound looks like a near the club. Why is yeah. a student there? Okay, let's do it. Uh, this sucks. <laughs> I'm serious. I was scared yeah, shitless. Right. Nice story, though. That was the Bayside Rockers, brought to you by KJ. And that's all for tonight, folks. Tune in again next week, yeah, same time, same place. It's about to end. The program you just heard was sponsored by Curito Electronics.
Kirijo? Electronics. It's zero, Kirijo? Is the clock hand I mentioned earlier? Huh? That's freaky. What the? Oh? What's happening to me? Oh, that's horrifying. Yeah. Hmm. He's still sleeping. The dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the hidden hour. During this time, an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs. Then he must be. Must be what? As you can see, he's retained his human form. He may be asleep, but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Though, come to think of it, he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. I feel kind of bad, though. Spying on him like this. Yeah, it should feel bad. What is this? Oh, oh that's nice. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Hello. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. Contract I wrote earlier. Let's stick with the game set. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. I heard this Igor voice before. One thing in return, abide by your contract and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. Mm, I don't understand. That is fine. For now. Hold on to this. Velvet key. Until we meet again. Where's the camera, though? Like, I need to find out. Wait, I didn't even wash myself. Huh? Oh, I skipped that. My bad. I feel exhausted. Maybe it's because I haven't gotten used to living here. Just who was that old man from the dream I had last night? What was that contract all about? Are we going in a oh the dark hour? How is he? Looks like he's a little worn out. He went to bed without changing out of his uniform. Other than that, nothing has changed since last night. Hmm. Very interesting. Even those who have the potential tend to be unstable at first. Memory loss, disorientation. 
This subject is rather unique. He hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. But we're treating him like a guinea pig. <laughs> yeah, you are. Oh, don't look at it like that. The two of you are classmates, right? Consider it an opportunity to have someone your own age here. Besides, we need all the help we can get. I guess that's true, but still. At least someone has a conscience. Command room speaking. Akihiko, what's wrong? <laughs> You're not gonna believe it. This thing is huge. Unfortunately, it's chasing after me right now. I'm almost back. Just letting you know in advance. You're leading it here? Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? Yeah. Mr. Chairman, that's enough observation for now. We need to prepare for combat. Uh, right. Be careful. Akihiko! <sighs> I'm alright. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. Why you look no excited? Is it one of them, Sanada-kun? Them? Yeah, but not an ordinary one. Ah! What was that? You've got to be kidding me! How big? Mr. Chairman, please head for the command room. Takeba, go upstairs and wake him up. Then escape out the back. But what about you two? We'll stop it here. You're the one who led it to us, Akihiko. So I'm going to have you fight. It's not like I asked it to follow me. What are you waiting for, Takeba? Go! Uh, okay. Loud noise woke me up. I should check what's happening outside. We have to get out of here now. Uh, what's going on? Hurry to the first floor. We'll leave through the back. Oh, wait. Take what? Take this just in case. Sure. Girl, why did you give me a sword for? Okay, let's go. We should be safe now. Takeba, do you read me? Y yes, I hear you. Be careful. There appears to be more than one enemy. The primary one's lurking somewhere nearby. Nearby? What? Back door. Best bet. Whatever is chasing us. Let's go. Go to safety. All right. This second floor. Sorry. All right, I know it's sudden when you were sleeping. I promise I'll explain later. What was that? What the heck is in this area? Don't tell me it got inside. Sounds like it. It's getting closer. Keep moving. Hurry. It's that slush sound.
Pelos. Oh, that's not creepy at all. That's it. One of the monsters that attacked us. It's a shadow. Uh, talk about? I mean, why are you giving up like this? Oh, that got knocked away. She was she gonna end it all? <laughs> she play at that thing out of yourself. It's here. <laughs> Wait. How are you in my head? Oh, they captured it quite nicely. I am thou. Thou art I. From the sea of thy soul I come. I am Orpheus. Master Strange. Orpheus talks. Interesting. Just as we thought. Did it evolve? What is, is this the still same one? Oh, he's standing no chance. Kind of gruesome. Reformed it. It's a witch of salt. Oh. Was that? <sighs> They're all shocked. Guess this is a first time thing. Awaken to power. Is it over? No! Oh, not yet. No! G get away from me! I need to protect her. We battle immediately? Oh, okay. Those shadows. Did they break off from that other one? Oh, I guess it's spread out. Hmm. I should conserve some. No. Let's not show any sympathy in this mode. Nice. Now to the other one. Now just normally attack it. Oh, nice. Dodged it. Simple. Oh, 
let's just run around. Are you okay? Oh, come on. Can you hear me? Oh, say something. Hmm. Nice little addition there. It's so good to see you again. You lost consciousness after awakening to your power. Ooh, I see that it was Orpheus who heeded your call. Very interesting. That was the power of Persona, the manifestation of your psyche. I said. A persona is a facet of your personality that surfaces as you react to external stimuli. You can think of it as a mask that protects you as you brave <laughs> many hardships. Really? A mask? The power of a persona is the power of one's soul. And the soul is fueled by the depth of one's bond. As you form these bonds by becoming involved with others, your own social links will gradually develop. The strength of these social links will foster the growth of your persona abilities. Please remember this. Now then, time marches on in your world. I shouldn't keep you here any longer. Next time we meet, you will come here of your own accord. Until then, farewell. Hmm, I'm gonna check later who's voicing Igor here. As I have heard it before. Whoa, I was a week out? Getting clearer. I can feel someone's presence beside me. How do you feel? Where am I? Thank goodness you finally woke up! Oh, this is Tatsumi Memorial Hospital. It's just a short walk from the station. The doctor couldn't find anything wrong. He said you were just exhausted. Hey, um, I'm sorry I wasn't helpful at all back there. But wow, that power of yours was really something. What were those things? You mean the shadows? They're what we're fighting against. And that power you used, we call it Persona. Don't worry, we'll explain everything later. I'm sorry I didn't tell you before. Hmm. I, uh... I wanted to tell you something. I can kinda relate. To you, I mean. Oh? What do you mean? My dad died in an accident when I was little. And my mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. You're all alone too, aren't you? To be honest, I already heard about your past. But it didn't seem fair, so I wanted you to know about mine too. Oh. This was a while ago, but there was a big explosion in the area. Supposedly, my dad died in the blast. But Ouch. Nobody really knows what happened. Sorry to hear At that. At the time, he was working in a lab run by the Kirijo group. So I'm hoping if I stick around long enough, I'll find out more about it. That's why I'm going to Gekukon High. Like, with Zero Kirijo? happened to you. Not that Poor I was family. Actually, I kind of panicked. That was my first time facing see, them, too. You're, see, you're here to seek answers. You wouldn't have to go through all this if I weren't such a coward. Hey. I was scared too. Really? But still, sorry for telling you all this the minute you opened your eyes. While I was waiting, I thought to myself, I've been hiding so many things from him. As soon as he wakes up, I'll tell him the truth. Hiding? So thanks for listening. I've been wanting to share that story with someone for a long time. All right, I'm going to get going. I'll let the others know you're okay. They said you could leave once you regain consciousness. So I think you're free to go home. See you. Ah, 
There you are. Looks like you've recovered. I'm glad to see that. There are some things I need to discuss with you. That's why I asked you to see me so soon after your discharge from the hospital. Uh, please, have a seat. Oh, before that, I believe I mentioned his name before, but this is Sanada-kun. Hey there. Hello. Okay, let me start off by asking you this. Would you believe me if I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours? Yeah, excuse me. <laughs> That's a reasonable reaction. However, you've already experienced this truth firsthand. Do you remember the night you first arrived here? You had to have noticed the signs. The street lights going out, things that stopped working, the inexplicable appearance of coffins. With so many things amiss, didn't it feel like you'd stepped into a different time? That's the dark hour. A time period hidden between one day and the next. Hidden. I guess it's more like something people simply aren't cognizant of. But the dark hour does exist, and it occurs each night at midnight. It will happen tonight, and every night to come. Normal people don't realize it, since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. But that's not what makes the dark hour so interesting. You saw them. Those creatures. We call them shadows. They only appear during the dark hour, and attack anyone who roams free outside the coffins. It's our job to defeat them. Pretty exciting, huh? Akihiko, why are you always like this? You just <laughs> got hurt the other day. Now, now. It just loves the thrill of fighting. In any case. Seems like that. I'll get to the point. We are the Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad. C's, for short. On paper, we're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the Shadows. Mitsuru Kirijokun is the leader, and I'm the club advisor. The shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. Apathy syndrome. I'm sure you've heard of it. We sometimes refer to those who suffer from this as the lost. They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news, if not all of them. Well, what about the police? Unfortunately, the police can't do a thing during the dark hour. Although rare, there are those who can function during the dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's known as Persona, the power you called upon the other night. Shadows can only be defeated by Persona users. That means you are the only ones who stand a chance against them. Mm. I'm glad you're quick to understand. What he's trying to say is, we want you to join us. We've prepared an evoker for you. We'd like you to lend us your strength. Alright. I was afraid you'd say no. I'm glad to hear you're on board. Thank you so much. Truly. Oh, I almost forgot. About your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> oh, okay. Hold up? But wasn't that... Oh, never mind. What? Join C's to fight the shadows. Hmm? I hear a voice ringing in my, inside my head. Oh, right. Here we go. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the fool arcana. I feel my like inner strength growing. Recall what Igor said about the power of social links. Well, that's all for today. I'll follow up with you regarding our club activities later on. 
Certain terms that have been displayed before messages, along with their descriptions, can be viewed by opening the menu of the triangle, going to system, and selecting dictionary. I apologize for gathering you all here on your precious day off. Tomorrow is Sunday, so take some time to relax. Well then, shall we end this meeting? You know, because it's the weekend. Shall we end? No, stop. Shall we stop. End? Shut up. Shut up. Get it? Shut up. Don't force it, bro. Hi. How have you been? Hello. What the heck are you doing in my room? How'd you get in here? I'm always by your side. Soon. The end will come. I remembered, so I thought I should tell you. The end? It's the end of everything, but to be honest, I don't really know much about it. More importantly, it looks like you've awakened to your power, and what an unusual power it is. A power that takes many forms, yet is bound by none, and might even prove to be your salvation depending on where you end up. Do you remember when we first met? I expect you to honor your commitment. I'm always watching you, even if you forget about me. Okay then, see you later. <laughs> Good to know. I have a kid that's always on my by, by my side. That's great. Hey, you in there? Oh. I can stop till night time. If you are, could you come downstairs? Sonata Senpai's calling for us. Oh. All right. Okay, he's here. So, what's this about? Thanks for coming. There's someone I want to introduce. Hey, hurry up. Just a sec. Oh, these things are freaking heavy. Oh. Well, Junpei, why are you here? Don't tell me. Uh oh. This is Junpei Yori from Class 2F. He'll be staying here from now on. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> He's staying here? Are you sure there wasn't some mistake? I bumped into him the other night. He has the potential, but he just awakened to it recently. I told him about us, and he agreed to help out. Really? You have the potential? He found me crying like a baby at the convenience store, surrounded Tough. by a bunch of coffins. I don't remember much, but man, that's embarrassing. <sighs> But he said that's, you know, completely normal in the beginning. Like being confused and not remembering anything. You guys know that? Mm -hmm. Oh, right. Of course. Makes sense since your persona is there and all. Man. Let's still lie a bit and tell him we no didn't experience that. We didn't on experience too. that, but, you know. Well, I'm glad I'm not the only one. Wouldn't really want to be doing this on my own. But you gotta be stoked too, right? Having me join? What? Uh, I guess. Well, enough of the introductions. Now that our forces have increased, I think we're about ready. Ooh, we gotta go do something? Sweetness! I'm getting pumped! With this many people, we could start checking out that tower. Tower? Oh, you mean Tartarus. Tartar sauce? What? What? It's a place that holds the key to understanding the dark hour. Or so we think. And the key. Huh. Mm. The chairman will give us more details tomorrow night, so be ready. Yo, you ready to kick some ass? I'm so glad I was invited to join. Plus, the dorm is pretty cozy. 
But the best part is that we're all the only ones who can fight the sh I mean enemies. Seem pretty good now. Well, Dad, I will be stoked about fighting for justice. Though, to be perfectly honest, I ain't got any single clue of what we're supposed to be doing. But I'm sure we'll find out. They say they did say that they'll explain everything. You watch too many cartoons, Jupei. I'm tired. I was about to fall asleep. You ready, Joe? Have a minute. Come to the room on the fourth floor when you get back to the dorm tonight. I have something to tell you all. Oh, are we having that talk already? I'll save the details for later. See you there. Yes, senpai. Damn, it doesn't waste any time. She's not like us. She's busy, you know, with the student council or whatever. Whoa, Yucatan, do I sense some hostility? Oh. It's not that I don't like her, it's just... I don't know. You will want... you will, can't relate to her. That's what you feel. Maybe? You okay? School days? Finally over. They're probably waiting for us at the dorm, right? Let's hurry back. <laughs> I would... no. Oh, the game just said, yep, we're shoving you in there. Finally made it. Oops. My bad. Can't believe the accident delayed our train so much. It's already dark out. It's been happening a lot lately though. People jumping onto the tracks. This apathy syndrome thing's getting out of control. It's like the whole world's falling apart. Oh shoot. Yeah, we better. They start running. The way they start running, it's like they have skates on. Oh man. I'm getting kinda hungry. It's small rocks! So many places to chow down. Uh they're open late. 420, by the way. I heard the ramen joint upstairs has a secret late night menu. Better hurry to the dorm. Everyone's here. Heck yeah! Let's get right into it! Now, I'd like your undivided attention. For a long time, Kirijo-kun and Sanada-kun were the only Persona users we had. But that number has recently jumped to five. So here's the plan. Starting tonight at 12 a.m., I'd like us to finally begin exploring... Here we go! Tartarus. Experiencing the very hard uh, mode. So, I asked this yesterday, but what is that Tartar thing again? It's Tartarus. You seriously haven't seen it, Junpei? Uh, I mean, it's no Hi. surprise you haven't seen it. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour, after all. Only during the dark hour? Just like the shadows. Interesting, huh? The goal of our club, Seas, is to fight those shadows. However, simply defeating shadows during the dark hour isn't enough. We must get to the root of the problem. We need to destroy the dark hour itself. Can that be possible? Uh, I don't really get it. Well, you're saying if we run around Tartarus, we can somehow get rid of the dark hour? We don't know for certain. Sorry I can't give you a better answer. But investigating the mysteries of that tower is part of our job. The bottom line is, we need more information. Everything we encounter there will be a vital clue for us. The exploration of Tartarus is of utmost importance. Consider it our top priority. Our society, while remaining blissfully unaware of the shadows, slowly but surely succumbing to their influence. 
I would go as far as to say that the fate of the world rests on the shoulders of you Persona users. No pressure, right? That's one hell of a responsibility. But the heroes of justice will prevail. It's also the perfect spot for us to train and improve our skills. That place is like a nest of shadows, you know. Whoa. They're nest, huh? But Senpai, what about your injury? Akihiko's still recovering from his wounds. He'll accompany us, but won't participate in the exploration. <sighs> yeah, I know. It's like taking a... <laughs> oh, Junpei's got you. Taking away the toys from a kid. I'm not so sure about this. What about you, Mr. Chairman? I'll stay here. Not much point, anyway, since I can't summon a persona. And how are you able to stay away? Huh? What? We're here? Uh, what's going on? Why are we at school? Just wait and see. It's almost midnight. As beautiful as I remember. And eerie. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. Labyrinth? What are you talking about? What happened to our school? Once the dark hour passes, everything will return to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? But why? Why'd our school turn into a giant tower? Calm down, Junbei. <sighs> you don't know either? Oh, they don't. No. Interesting. I'm sure it's complicated. If we don't know, we'll just have to find out. Mitsuru and I have only gone in to take a peek. This will be our first time exploring it. Exciting, huh? There's gotta be something in there. Hopefully some sort of clue about the dark hour. Hey. Akihiko, I respect your enthusiasm, but you won't be exploring it today. I know. You don't have to keep reminding me. <laughs> well, this is Tartarus. In any case, decide to enter the town. It's just as crazy on the inside. Sure is creepy, though. This is only the entrance. The labyrinth lies beyond the doorway at the top of these stairs. First, you need to get a feel for the place. Why don't the three of you go have a look around? What? By ourselves? We're not asking you to go very far. I'll help you navigate by feeding you information from here. We'll also need to appoint a leader to make any necessary decisions. A leader? Like, the captain of a pirate ship? Dude, the hints <laughs> of Persona 5. It's been three now. You're in charge. Wait, why him? He doesn't look like a captain. Calm down. He has experience fighting already. That's true. Wait, seriously? Yeah. That's true too, but the main reason is far more simple. Junpei, and you too, Takeba. Can either of you summon your persona without difficulty like he can? Yeah, of course I can. Me too. Uh, These are shadows we're talking about. Without your persona, you're screwed. Harry, you have hesitated before. All right, let's head inside. What are you, about? Are you ready, leader? 
I'm ready. <laughs> That's the spirit. Oh. Oh, that looks cute. What's the matter? The door over there. Strange door is sitting in the corner lobby. for you the time has come for you to wield your power the tower that you are about to venture into how did it come to be for what purpose does it exist regrettably you are not yet capable of answering these questions that is why you must be made aware of something before you go any further you must understand the nature of your power in nature your power is unique it is like the number zero empty but at the same time holding infinite possibilities you my boy are able to possess multiple personas and summon them at will and when you have defeated your enemies you will see the faces of possibility before you there may be time when they are difficult to grasp but do not fear seize what you have earned your power will grow accordingly be sure to keep that in mind now then my spare time will soon be scarce next time once again may you open the door and come here of your own accord i'll tell you then about my true role the manner in which I can best assist you. Oh. Until we meet again. Oh, I get it. Farewell. I know what he means. I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. It's hey, are you exciting. Right? Yeah, what's up? You look like a zombie. Nothing. Don't tell me you dozed off. You're like that coach who fell asleep during the championship game. Come on, man. You're supposed to be our leader. They don't seem to see the door. Cut him some slack. If nothing's wrong, then let's get going. Thank you for talking about. Hey, can I? Leader. The entrance to the labyrinth is at the top of the stairs. Whenever you you feel ready to start. Lead the way. All right, let's experience the very hard mode. All right. All ready? Yeah. Let's see how this is. So, it's the real deal from here on, huh? Looks easy to get lost in. Can you all hear me? Yeah. Whoa! Is that you, Senpai? I'll be providing audio backup from here on out. Keep that in mind. Wait, are you saying you can see this place from all the way out there? It's my persona's ability. Oh. The structure of Tartarus actually changes from day to day. I'd like to join you up there, but we need someone to provide outside support. That's, fair. That's even more concerning. Now, based on your current location, you can expect to encounter enemies at any time. This shouldn't be too tough, but proceed with caution. You'll get the hang of it as you go. Right. Got it. Why is she always like that? Sharp tongue, you mean? Let's begin. Defeat all the shadows on that floor. I'll support you as much as I can, but it's up to you to learn something. Oh, out there. here we go. Oh, I can't press X. Oh, it's square. Okay, L1 is map. So that's the audio. R1. 
We can still dash. Oh, I like that. Hmm. Oh, and there's still red dots on the map. Oh uh, man, this is just. Hold on. There's a shadow up ahead. This, this is mandatory. Battle for Takeba and Diori. Next, I'm going to explain a tactic for defeating several enemies at once. First, go ahead and strike an enemy's weakness. I'll keep track of tactical data, such as any enemy weaknesses you've identified. Alright. If you ever forget an enemy's affinities, just let me know and I'll get that data for you. Got it. Brain, uh, fire. I'll go with a new song. Now we can do it. Let's wipe them out. Let's do it. Nice shuffle time. Oh, thank you, Kurosawa san. I'll be taking this. Oh. These are the guys I was talking about earlier. Oh? Hmm. oh? Hello. This is Officer Kurosawa. He helps keep our squad well equipped. Oh, and here. This is from Ikutsuki san. Oh. Wow. Whoa, is that our war plans? You shouldn't have. You can't fight empty handed, so find something you like. Kurosawa san has connections, he can secure equipment for us. Oh, shoot. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. But these things still cost money. Of course. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. I will this this. I realize that. Well, I'll see you later. Thanks again. I've been informed about you two. My job is to maintain peace in this city regardless of the circumstances. I'm just an ordinary police officer, but it doesn't take a genius to know something strange is going on here. I'm only doing what I think is right. Nothing more. If you need something, we can talk in the back. Head back to the dorm just in case. And there you have it. It was not even time to go shopping. You're still at it? Yes. You never know when an enemy might appear. But I thought you couldn't scan outside of Tartarus. To be honest, I am indeed lacking in that area. Maybe this is the best Penthesilea can do in terms of data gathering. Though I must say, the power of Persona seems to be much more diverse than I once thought. We even have someone who can switch Personas in the midst of battle. There's something special about his ability. And it hasn't even been that long since his awakening. Yeah, I was surprised too. But in the end, it's up to him whether or not he reaches his full potential. Hmm? It's a shadow. What? You actually found one? Hey, something's not right. The reading is too big. I've never detected an enemy of this size. Sounds bad. Is it like that huge one from last month? I think so. Oh, well then. This is gonna be fun. I'll wake up the others. <laughs> I just realized what Wakiko said. Where is it? I'll rip it a new one. We've detected a shadow outside of Tartarus. We don't know for sure, but we think it's another big one like we saw last month. We must defeat any we find out there as quickly as possible. People may not be aware of the Dark Hour's existence, but if the city is destroyed during that time, inconsistencies will be left behind. In other words, we need to kick some ass, right? Well, count me in! <sighs> Junpei... Akihiko. You stay here and wait for the chairman. What? Are you 
kidding? I'm going. You still need time to recover. Like this, you'd only get in the way. What you say? Go. No. They'll fare better than you in your current state. Have faith in them, Akihiko. They've already seen battle firsthand. Damn it. Relax. I've got it covered. <sighs> Guess I don't have a choice. You're in charge. Him again? Yes, you pay. Can you do it? I'll do my best. Good. We're counting on you. At this rate, he'll be stuck playing leader forever. I mean, not like I care. Clearly. You should let the three of them go first. You need to get ready, right? Yes. Let's rendezvous in front of the station. Got it. All right, let's go. Where is she? She'll be here soon. There's a full moon tonight. Looks even creepier during the dark hour. Huh? What the? Sorry to keep you waiting. Let me establish this. Listen carefully. Tonight I'll be providing support from here. Everything else is the same. The shadow is currently located on a monorail not far from the station. To get there, you'll have to walk on the tracks. Uh, are you serious? Isn't that dangerous? Not to worry. Electronic equipment is rendered inoperable during the dark hour, including trains. But your bite? Oh, right. This was specially made to handle it. Now, if circumstances change, I'll notify you immediately. All right, let's get started. Okay. Yeah, let's do this. It'll be fine, right? It's not like I'm in very hard mode or anything. <sighs> Holy hell, we are real high up. I think I'm gonna hurry. <sighs> what even? What even what? There should be a monorail about 200 meters ahead from where you are now. Oh? Get there as quickly as you can. We don't want any passengers to get hurt. In the angle, I thought I was going to use top of yeah. Look how big it is. It's going down. Jeez. I mean, don't get too excited and do something stupid. Is that stopped? Is it that stop on right there? This is it, right? Can you all hear me? Yes, loud and clear. We just got here, but I don't see anything out of the ordinary. The readings are definitely coming from that monorail. Proceed with caution and stay together. Mm. My persona is just itching for a fight. Well then, let's head on in. I thought we were gonna be outside. Oh. You dare look up. Yeah, yeah. I won't. Uh, hmm. So. But don't blame me if I happen to catch a glimpse. Junpei. Say, why don't we dig Junpei a nice grave? <laughs> Sure. Oh, wow. That dango actually was fire. You won. Now let's move on. Making the dream work. I don't know these trophies. I'll check them out. Probably when I finish the game. That's what happens when you don't listen. Are you okay? Of course I am. I was doing just fine. Hey, what's your problem? Be careful, you three. I don't detect any movement, but stay alert. Ooh. 
Well, we got movement now. What the? Why are we moving? It looks like the entire monorail is under the shadow's control. What? Is that really okay? Uh, this doesn't look good. If we don't stop it, it's going to crash into the next train. Crash? Crash? Oh, calm down. Hey, what are we gonna do? Down and listen. I detect a powerful reading in the front car that must be our target. You'll have to defeat that to stop the runaway train. If this that's it. Kinda messed up ride, is this? Need to save up SP. So I'll switch to Aki, uh, uh, Junpei. The enemy can handle it. Good hit. Do it. I got your best. What's the plan? I'm in the Enemy down. Keep that up, Yori. I'm in the We're done. Move on. If I was eleven, media or there's no time. Run. I think I'm fine with SP. If anything really happens, I I have a snuff soul. There it is. The hell is this? Hello. <laughs> That's our target. It has to be. There's nowhere else to go. Here. <laughs> Swag. Just pulled him aside. Oh, boss time. this big before but there's no time we have yeah. to end this now did it have a timer last time exactly 30 minutes time 30 didn't they do much invitation to chaos time's going faster Take care of those things. Not like this. Eeyore is out. Can you help him? GG. Dang, man. Let's see. Death is not counter unbeknownst to its prey. One is always aware that it lies in wait. Though life is merely a journey to the grave, it must not be undertaken without hope. Only then will all travelers' story live on, treasured by the I cannot read that completely. Y'all have to attack now.
13 seconds to spam. Oof. Ooh, that was a close one. Crash. What are you waiting for? You're coming up on the next train fast. Damn it! I don't know how to stop this thing. Bring it to me. It's no time to think. Just pull anything. Actually, read quickly and make sure it's not for accelerating. Did we stay? Emergency brakes. Yeah, that. Uh, I think so. Do you read me? Is everyone all right? Uh, yeah. We're okay. <laughs> my, my knees are shaking. Dude, I'm like drenched in sweat. Sounds like you're Pain. You were close to dying. I'm sorry I couldn't do more to help on my end. I don't detect any more shadows. Well done. You can come on back now. Wait, how did you know which one was the break? <laughs> Lucky guess. Are you shitting me? Uh, you know what? Never mind. Anyone want to grab a bite to eat on the way? They usually have highlighted what the emergency brakes are. Oh, he should have done that. You keep calm in a situation like that. Not everyone can do it. Realistically speaking, yeah. It's me. Reporting in from the scene. We've just finished up over here. The monorail did not sustain any noticeable damage. A job well done, Kirijo-kun. Huh. When I heard they hijacked a monorail, I feared the worst. Excellent work taking care of that. Now I don't have to worry about tomorrow's headlines. The team did a great job. They've learned a lot in a surprisingly short time. But what was up with the shadows? They've never done something like hijacking a train before. This is getting out of hand. I'll be looking into the matter. Does this mean it's begun? Begun. Hmm. Let's not jump to any conclusions. For now, we should study their behavior for patterns or clues. We can't afford to keep waiting for them to make the first move. If only I had more power. Things wouldn't be so difficult for everyone. I just realized something. Don't be so hard on yourself. You're doing fine. My bad. Do you have anything to drink, Sanada-kun? It was too bright. Uh -huh. Why do you look so tired, Ikutsuki-san? Wait. Don't tell me that bicycle outside is yours. I didn't notice still now. Oh, recording. So if it's not one thing, it's another. Boy from my dreams. The thing about hardship seems like this should be true. Wonder what this could mean. Too exhausted to make any sense of it right now. Should rest as soon as I get back from the dorm. 